Hi guys, this is Abhi from Goksha DB, and in this video, you're going to learn 15 ways to reduce your bill in AWS. Let's get into it. Number one, leverage AWS Cost Explorer to visualize, understand, and manage your AWS costs and usage over time. It allows you to analyze your data at a high level or dive deeper to identify trends, pinpoint cost drivers, and detect anomalies. Stay tuned, there's more to come. Number two, use reserved instances. They allow you to commit to a certain amount of usage in exchange for a lower hourly rate. By using reserved instances, you can save up to 72% on your compute costs. Howdy, partner. Number three, make use of auto-scaling. Auto-scaling allows you to automatically adjust the number of instances running based on demand. This can help you avoid over-provisioning and reduce your costs. Giddy up. Number four, utilize EC2 spot instances to run fault-tolerant workloads for up to 90% off. Spot instances allow you to bid on unused EC2 capacity and run your workloads at a much lower cost. However, keep in mind that spot instances can be terminated in just two minutes of notice. Keep your formation! Number five, use the AWS Lambda service, which allows you to run code without provisioning or managing servers. By using AWS Lambda, you can save costs on server management and maintenance. That's what I'm talking about. Number six, utilize CloudFront for content delivery. Amazon CloudFront is a content delivery network that helps you distribute your content to end users with low latency and high transfer speeds. By using CloudFront, you can reduce your server load and save costs on bandwidth. Attention! Number seven, leverage AWS Trusted Advisor. Trusted Advisor provides recommendations that help you follow AWS best practices. It evaluates your account by using checks that identify ways to optimize your AWS infrastructure, improve security, performance, and reduce costs. Company, halt! Number eight, use AWS budgets to improve planning and cost control with flexible budgeting and forecasting. It allows you to track your costs and create custom actions to prevent overages. Number nine, make use of instance size flexibility. AWS offers instance size flexibility, which allows you to change the instance size of your running EC2 instances to optimize costs. Yeehaw! Number 10, AWS offers savings plans, which allow you to commit to a consistent amount of usage for a one or three year term and receive discounts on your usage. That's what I'm talking about. Number 11, upgrade instances to the latest generation. AWS regularly releases new generations of instances with better performance and cost effectiveness. By keeping your EC2 instances up to date, you can keep your compute costs low. Stay tuned, there's more to come. Number 12, use consolidated billing if you have multiple AWS accounts. You can combine the usage across all accounts in the organization to share the volume pricing discounts, reserved instance discounts, and savings plans. This can result in overall lower costs. Attention! Number 13, utilize S3 intelligent tiering, which automatically moves data between four access tiers based on changing access patterns and can help you save costs on S3 storage. Number 14, leverage CloudFormation. 
cloud formation enables you to create and manage AWS resources using templates, which can help you automate your infrastructure and reduce costs. Yeah, 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 yeah. Last but not the least, number 15. Make sure that you turn off any resources that are not in use 